Hi, I'm Brett. This is Guitar Increase. And in this video, we're going to go over a very difficult to play chord, but we're going to make it not difficult, and that is E flat. You really only need three notes E flat, G, and A sharp. There's your E flat chord, super easy. Another way to play E flat is put your first finger on the sixth fret of the A string and your third finger on the eighth fret of the D string, pinky on the eighth fret of the G string, and just play it like that. If you want, you can kind of bar your pinky, or you can just use your pinky like that. You definitely don't want the low E string to ring out, so what you can do to mute it is take your first finger and play it a little higher than normal, and that'll mute the low E string so it won't ring out. And of course, try not to play the low E string. And what you can do is put your palm here and mute it that way. Another E flat power chord is put your first finger on the 8th fret of the G string and then your pinky on the 11th fret of the B string. And you can mute the D string by putting your first finger a little higher or you can bar it on the D string, add that note, and you can also bar your pinky on the high E string, or just play it like this. A different way to play E flat is like this. So to do that, you put your pinky on the 6th fret of the A string, 3rd finger on the 5th fret of the D string, and then next is quite a stretch, you put your 1st finger on the 3rd fret of the G string, and then your 2nd finger is going to go on the 4th fret of the B string. You can get some nice sounds with this. bad. And last but not least is you can just play an E major chord and tune down a half step, which I don't feel like doing. So maybe it is least. So, but that's another way to do it if you can, if you want. So that's a couple different ways to play E flat. It's not impossible. And if this has been helpful to you, please let me know in the comments or if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. See you next time.